what is up we are now in shop titans ladies and gentlemen um i've been playing shop titans for a while and actually i've streamed it once or twice before um i actually like it i've never really um done a time management auto battler idler type game um and if they're if they're all like this then I've been missing out, but I've been playing Shop Titans for a little over a year now, and I love it. It's fun. It's basically just point and click. Um, it's free to play, and if you're willing to sink time into it, it's free to win. Now, there are some paid mechanics, and when I say paid mechanics, it's not pay to win. It's pay to customize, basically. It's like, um, if you just play the game, you can you can unlock everything to get to, I say, the end, but to, you know, where you're basically maxed out. Um, that takes a long time, which is fine, or uh, an inordinate amount of time playing it if you, like, have a, a work-from-home job or a job where you can just have it on your phone and nobody cares that you're playing on your phone all the time. Me, I only log in about three or four times a day, which is why I'm not as high as some of the people in the game. Um, I've been playing it for over a year, and I'd be a lot further along if um, I was a little bit more dedicated at it, but I'm, I'm really not. Um, but it's fun. The battles are really fun, and if you want to skip to the end of the battles, you can. There are some skipping mechanics in this, which is awesome. I love that. Also, I'm uh, still battling a little bit of that stomach bug. It's I'm not nearly as sick as I was yesterday, um, so I'm a little bit more on and whatnot. I am in incredibly congested. I don't know why. Um, there's really not a lot of pollen out because it's been raining for two days. So I don't know why I'm so congested. I'm not like sick congested. I, I, it feels like allergies, but who knows? Anyway, um, if you click on the little heart, you go to someone else's shop and you get the option to go help them by clicking on these little bad boys. And you have to click on them three times. You can also just click on this and it'll take you to it if, you, if it's out of frame and you can't see it. And every time you help someone, your friendship increases. It's a fun little game. Um, I played this on both my tablet and my computer. I had it on my phone, but my phone, um, my phone's really angry at me. Um, I dropped my phone and cracked it, and ever since then, I've had a problem with the touch screen. It's not as touchy as it used to be. Um, and believe it or not, um, I've had cell phones since like the first ones came out, like the big the big ones, and I've dropped several and never broke a single screen until this one, and I've had this one for about two years, so it's it's time to upgrade anyway. Like I said, uh, if you click on the big red heart in the center, if you have to help anyone, um, it'll be in green right here, and you just click help all, and it'll help all of them, and you get some of these little feathers. I have like five grand saved up, and I could use them, but I'm saving them for a rainy day. Now, you can also use your gems, which are these bad boys right here, um, and that will instantly uh, help these people finish upgrading whatever piece of whatever they're upgrading in their shop, but I'm not going to do that because they're my gems, and as much as I love my guildies, don't get me wrong, I do love my guildies, those are my gems, and I've worked hard for them, and I'm, I'm actually planning on using them soon to finish upgrading my shop. <sighs> it's been a day. I'm very tired, actually, but we are still going to power through, play a little bit of Shop Titans, take a like a five or ten minute break, and then we're going to hop on and do some Skyrim. I'm excited, and I've got some news for Skyrim, but I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to spoil it until we're in Skyrim. And see, this is the auto battler. You don't have to do anything. It's doing all of it. Now, if you click on the screen, it'll go through it quicker. You can also skip the battle, which I'll do in the next one. Now they have to sleep for three hours and 35 minutes unless I revive them, like force revive them. Um, so if I want to skip the battle, all I would do is click on skip here. 
and I get my loot, and he's dead, and my my girl here soloed him, literally soloed him. To be fair, she's kind of high, and he's kind of low. And then this here, this is the Lost City of Gold. It's an event that's going on right now for the weekend. So tomorrow, I'll be um, playing it, not non-stop, non-stop, but a lot during the day on this monitor when I'm not um, um, streaming. Like, I'll get up in the morning and I'll do my, my morning chores. Like, I gotta go put gas in my car, which, you know, means I'm gonna be missing an arm and a leg tomorrow on stream. But, um, I'll leave it running right here because it takes a while for you to disconnect from the server. I think it's longer than 15 minutes, like, most of the stuff. Now, right now it's telling me I have to repair some items. So, that's what we're gonna do. Now, that's a lot of gold and I've worked hard for the... 1.27 gazillion gold. <laughs> so I'm going to use one of my repair things to um, repair that. Same for that one. That one there, I'll go ahead and use my gold because it's less than 200,000. And how much gold did I get? I got 22, and these are my rewards. I got, this is used for making runestones, which you use to enchant your gear. I tend to just sell those outright because... Um, if you enchant a piece of gear, it works great for a piece of gear that your heroes are wearing. But if you try to sell it um, in the market, which is like the auction house, you have to take all the enchantments off and then you lose the work you put into it. Now, if you want to sell enchanted gear in your shop, you can. But you get like the base value. You know, you, you, can, you can double the price of it once, but it doesn't always work. Um, whereas if you sell something in the auction house, you can go as high as like, I think 10 times the normal price. You can really make some gold in their little, in their little market. I've, I've made a lot of gold in that market. So anyway, we're going to hustle through this because it's already 140 and I've got 20 minutes to make sure that my Skyrim is working properly. And I have to go ahead and load up the character before I start streaming because if I stream the opening menu... Like the, 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 you know, the like new game, continue, load, credits, whatever mods. If you stream that with the music playing, I will get a strike. And I don't want a strike. So we're going to hustle through this. And seeing as how um, my characters, I'm clicking to skip through a lot of this. I know I'm going way too fast for you guys and I'm really sorry, but... I'm really, I'm really can't wait for Skyrim. And in between this stream, that's only a couple of minutes, and the Skyrim stream, which will be, I don't know how long, but hopefully we'll be uninterrupted by lag and whatnot. So far, we're doing good, but this is a short one. Twenty-one gold. That's not bad. Now, the goal is to fill up these little things, and each time you fill them up, it's because you hit one of these numbers, right? And each time you fill them up, you get a piece of loot. Now, I'm actually a subscriber to this game. It's $9 a month, um, which is the same price I played for Fallout first, and I play Fallout 76 a lot less than this game. I play this game every day, multiple times a day, so I'm getting my money's worth. And so what that means is I'm able to actually um, get this extra bit of loot that has the crown on it. Now, I'm not telling you people to do that. Um, I do it for myself. That That's my personal financial choice. But I'm not saying that any of y'all have to, or need to, or even should. That's something that only you can decide to do. I will say that if you are a, a um, I think it's called a merchant, or a patron, or something like that. Um, if you are, you get some cool swag. Um, and you get a couple of extra things. But, like I said, you can play this game completely for free. Completely for free. It's free to download. It's in the Google Play Store. It's a lot of fun. I have, um, only reason I took it off my phone was because it wasn't working. But if I get a new phone, it's going back on. It's, it's not addictive, but it is a lot of fun. And it's one of those things that you can play for three minutes, 30 minutes, or three hours, depending on how you play. If you want to just sit there and, like, look out the window while the... Uh, battles idle or your last couple of things upgrade or you craft. Oh, I got to set my crafting. I was about to forget. You guys have got me so distracted. So let's, let's craft a few things. I'm working on um, filling this out so I can get some more spears, but okay, so I'm out of that. So now we're going to make some more plate armor. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. Yes. All right, now I'm out of those, and I'm out of these little bars here anyway, so we're going to make some more Vestal Raymonds. That's it. And right now I can only craft, I believe, nine things at a time. I could craft more, but I'd have to unlock that. And like I said, that costs either um, gold or um, gems, and I'm, I'm holding off on that. Now we're going to finish upgrading. Actually, I think we're going to upgrade my resources. I say that. Oh, I can't because the ironwood sawmill has not been upgraded. Oh, no. I've actually got space in here. Oh, I got an idea, people. Oh, I got an idea. Oh, I got an idea. I can hide. I didn't know I could hide those in there. Okay. 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 So what we're going to do is, I, I wonder if I can upgrade my store. I don't really need to upgrade my storage. I need to upgrade my crafting materials. So jewels. Oh, you know what? Oh, uh, how much does it cost? 15 grand, 15 million, not grand. I can't count today. That's a lot. That's why I hold on to my gold in my gems as much as possible. It'll take one day and 13 hours. Now, that's true. It will take one day and 13 hours. But if I click on the little red heart thing, I now ask my guild members for help. And I'm in a guild of like 16 people. And if even eight people, I'll click on the little help thing. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't exit. Go back to the city. If you click on this little heart thing, my name will pop up in there. And if you're, if even eight people click help that will cut it down to probably just a couple of hours like helping someone shaves off 30 minutes the first time and then an hour the second time and it just I think it exponentially builds I could be wrong but I think that's how it works I haven't really super paid attention but anyway um so this is 694.13 K 49.27k and 116.46k. So that's how I'm making my gold. Uh, we're going to sell these noble rings because I think they sell for a good bit. Actually, no, they're actually selling for a lot less than what they're actually worth. So we're not going to sell those. Let's sell. Well, we'll get rid of the spiked cudgel because I don't need it. I don't even know what's in there. And it's the, it's selling, the most it's selling for right now is 12.10, so I'm going to sell mine for 12.05. I always undercut by like 5 gold, sometimes 50 or 100, depending on the, on the item and how many of them I'm selling. Uh, green items tend to sell pretty quickly. Four, five, thirty. All right. See, Ruska has helped me upgrade my furniture. I don't know if that's actually showing up on screen, but that's where this, where my mouse is right now. Um, so now let's see. Um, now it's only going to take that shaved four hours off. Actually, that's awesome. And I just realized I don't have my um my thing up. There we go. Oh, my stomach is growling. I'm so sorry. I haven't eaten hardly anything. Wait, what did I eat today? Oh, I did eat today. I'm lying. I'm a big fat liar. I had, um, from the deli at my store, uh, turkey and cheese sliders on Hawaiian, the little Hawaiian rolls. Now that's a big deal for me because I don't eat hardly any bread anymore. I've been on a, on a bit of a diet, um, for like the last 20 years of my life. No, um, for a while now. I'm just trying to shave off maybe 10 or 15 more pounds. And if you cut um, bread out of your diet, you'll win. Now, that being said, I really have been cheating the last day or so. Well, I say that yesterday I didn't eat hardly anything or the day before because I've been so sick. Um, so I feel like I get a pass. So today I had those little sliders. I had four of them. They were about this big if you put them together. And then t tonight we're having pizza. I'm sorry, but I want pizza. 
<laughs> I, sorry, not sorry. Um, and so the next time I hop on here, which we, which will be tomorrow, um, I will um, show you how you can uh, move stuff around in here and change the content of your tables and racks and stuff and explain more about bins and whatnot. But we're going to go ahead and exit out of this, and I'm going to shut the stream off for a couple of minutes while I get Skyrim ready. And then um, I'll hop in Skyrim with you guys, and we'll have a grand old adventure. And for some reason, every single time I get on Skyrim, I don't know why, even when I'm not streaming, I tell myself, like uh, uh, Bilbo says in The Hobbit, I'm going on an adventure! Like, I always do that. I don't know why, but I love Skyrim. Skyrim's one of those games that is infinitely replayable, infinitely moddable, and every time it could be a completely different experience. So, yep. I will see you guys on the flip side in about uh, 14 minutes or so. Happy hunting! If I can get the darn thing to stop. Stop streaming!